even if you do that, it's a tough pitch to keep fair. So it was a strikeout swinging. Roberto Perez goes down for the first out of the game. Chris Davis started to go around, but it's a called strike, 0-1. Swing and a miss. It's 0-2. Let's get it going, boys. Somebody's loose, hitting 98 with ease in the first inning. In the dirt, but swung on and missed. Oh. He makes the throw to first. Two down. Here's Tommy Lastella now. Will attempt to put the ball in play for a change here with the first two guys going down on strikes to start the inning. Grounded to first. Scooped up, and he'll step on the bag himself in the inning. Next up, the two-way Japanese import, Shohei Otani. It'll leave things off here in the bottom half of the first. Now a swing and a miss. Took something off that one, and it's strike one. Fouled away. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. Center fielder looking up at the track, the wall, and this ball is gone. No chance to make a play on that one. Baseball has really changed. Remember when leadoff guys were guys who would just draw walks and steal bases? But that's not the case anymore. Guys like this, they have pop in their bat. They can go deep. The second baseman. As he'll lay out the third ball in the dirt for ball one. Line towards center field. And he will run this one down, moving to his right, and that's the first out of the inning. Now at the plate, here is Jordan Alvarez. One run in and one gone so far in the center. As he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. Line to second where it's caught there for out number two. Batting four. Bases are empty here with two away. And in the bat now will be Gary Sheffield. Out in front of it, strike one. Swing and a soft liner. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side. All set for the start of the inning, and set to go is the third baseman, Eduardo Escobar. And he just gets a piece there as this is chopped foul. Ball. Hey, when you're featuring a mid-90s fastball like this pitcher, attack with that pitch. Get ahead. Get the offense on their toes. That opens up the off-speed pitches later in the game. And he takes strike three called on the fastball. One gone. Stepping in next, Glaber Torres. Swing and a miss on a ball inside. 0-1. Oh that was some smoke right there. High fire right on by. And he falls behind 0-2. Oh Boy, so far early into this one, this guy's pitching really well. And I'm a big believer in body language. He's getting the ball. He's working really quick, keeping the ball down in the zone. And if you take a look at this guy so far early on, a lot of positive signs. He looks like he brought his good stuff in this one. One ball, no strikes to count. And that pitch misses in the dirt, and it's 2-0 and now. Man, you could tell by the sound of that one off the bat, that was going a long way. That except the center fielder, number two, Jonathan Daza. In now, Jonathan Daza. Now he starts to chase the pitch outside, and he can't pull the bat back in time. It's strike one. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Fouled off. Now the 0-2. Nope. 
That's inside. Slow roller out to short. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And here comes the first baseman, Lewin Diaz. As he'll look at a breaking ball that misses for ball one. That's wide, 2-0. Looked like he went around that time. They'll appeal down to third, and yes, sir, it's strike one. Brent Suter, the 6'4 southpaw, comes in out of the bullpen to do the pitching. The 2-1. Rounded back up the middle, and that's a base hit, so the pressure's on to open up the inning. And that'll bring up Glaber Torres. Labor. Oh, line. That's a base hit. Standing in now, Michael Conforto. Rip down the first base line. And foul ball here, 0-1. Hit hard on the ground towards second. And that's through into center field. Base hit. Go-ahead run will move up to third and wisely hold there with nobody out. At the plate, Leury Garcia he swings and grounds it to short. Torres has it, and he is out on the tag. On the first, and it's a double play, although the run does come into score from third. So next to bat will be Gary Sanchez. Gary in scoring position with Sukan. Here's the first pitch to him. Short, hit hard. And that's through into left, a base hit. And to score is the runner from third. It's now three to one. Torres brings it in. Jonathan Davis will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. First pitch of the A-B on its way as he'll go after a hard sinker oh, that time and falls behind nothing and one. Trying to keep things going now with a runner at first following the RBI single. Ground ball left side. Throw on to Davis takes care of him and that'll end the inning. Kendall Graveman is on, and he'll take over on the mound in relief. Top of the third set to get underway. And the right-handed hitting Nicholas Castellanos will bat next. And that's cut on and missed 0-1. You have to find a way to lay off that low sinker. There is just no way to do any damage. You're just looking at either a bruised shin or a ground out to the left side. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Turning for second is Castellanos. And he will pull into second with a leadoff double. Colin Moran will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. From the stretch, here's the pitch. As he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty, it's strike one. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. Swung underneath that pitch, so he was either trying to elevate the ball or he was expecting a pitch to be a sinker and drop more than it did. And it's fouled away. Working for the punch out and the offering. They really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. 
Now back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, Roberto Perez. A decent lead at second, here's the pitch. Set to deliver the 0-1. And, and they go away here, it's a cold strike, nothing in two. Hey, with first base open, pitcher's definitely going to nibble and try and see if the hitter expands his own. A uh, great pitch there as he couldn't get extended on that one, and he's down on strikes for the second out. Aroldis Chapman gets the call here as he'll try and look for one out to finish this thing off. And he fouls this one off. One and one, the count to Chris Davis. Castellanos. Stands at second with two gone. One one pitches a slider that's one cut two. on and missed for strike two. Yeah, guys, he's got so much respect for this guy's fastball. You could tell he was out in front on that slider. Oh, on to first, and the ball game is over. Well, they aren't going to the two and barbecue in this battle royale run as they get their first win. We'll see if they can go on a run and make some noise. Three to one, the final score this afternoon. Norfolk took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Shohei Otani gets the W on the mound. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Flezak, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to the new website, theshow.com. Here now is our final line score. First for your victorious home team. Three runs, five hits, no errors, and they left one man on base.